I'm your neighborhood reporter in Waco, Bella Papaduke. Need to go vote but don't have a ride? Waco Transit is offering free rides to the polls on election day to make sure everyone can cast their ballot. Like some people like are motivated to vote because like it's their birthday, but for people that just like think of it as like like just like something like just to get one and done like as a chore, I feel as though they won't come if they don't have rides to get here. Baylor freshman Ariel Canton voted early for the first time on Friday, and just like me, Ariel was able to drive herself to the polls. She tells me many college students don't have cars and rely on other types of transportation. I think it's really nice because like not a lot of college students brought their car because they don't have one or they don't have their license or they usually have to like share a car with like their sibling or something like that. So. I think it's really nice that they're like offering buses for people. On election day, the Waco Transit System will be offering free rides on all fixed routes when you show your voter registration card or I voted sticker. I think we are a very vital part of the community. Director of the Waco Transit System, Charles Parham Jr. tells me the city has provided this service for several years now. We want everyone to take the opportunity if they can to go out and vote. And if uh, us providing transportation will help assist with that process, that's what we would like to do. You can find routes by looking at the Ride Systems app or the City of Waco webpage to see the nearest polling places. The buses also have a flag stop system, meaning you can flag down a bus to stop where you need and you don't have to be at a specific location. Charles tells me he expects Election Day to be business as usual and does not expect any delays. He says Waco Transit gets around 800,000 people each year and more than 2,000 people each day across all services.